you've been in the game you've seen you've seen people that have been ultra successful and that have have taken it to the next level so for you what 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 catches your eye when it comes to someone talented because keep in mind obviously this day and age is a little bit different this social media day and age is a little bit it's a different. lot different it's a lot yeah different. you know so and i know you're it's kind of twofold with you because you knew how to find talent back then but you've also found some great talent now as well and you're doing things in film and all types of things so for you what attracts you to to an artist or a creative? Like, what really attracts you? Is it their Instagram page? Is it their music videos? Is it their following? Like, what do you what do you look for? What attracts you, and what catches your eye? It's a combination of all those things. Um, you know, I definitely want to see if if I see a star. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I want to see if the person can think outside the box. You know, number one, educating themselves about the business that they're in so they know what steps to take uh, as they're putting their music out. Now, that is very attractive to me as, as a consultant or a manager. Um, that's because people are taking care about what it is that they're trying to do. And, um, you know, so once the artistry is there, once the knowledge is there, I'm seeing how they're working their social media. You know what I'm saying? Are, are they doing things, you know, aside from the obvious? Like how much out of the box thinking are they do? Are they doing? Or are they just trying to duplicate what other people are doing? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. If I can stop, if they, they got reels and I can stop and watch, like, okay, yo, this seems to be very, very interesting. Cause I, I go, I do, I sit down and go through reels. I spend hours going through reels, just watching a lot of that stuff and most of it I scroll through it has to be something special for me to stop and be like hmm okay that's that's interesting that that's I, I think I would buy into that yeah. you know I have yet to be stopped well I saw a couple of female musicians that were dope that would get up there and they would play and, and that you know they were dope um, but they didn't change it up enough for me to, to keep my interest. Got you. Um, Got you. So I'm, I'm watching how 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 they move on social media. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, it's just a combination of, of all of these things. Um, because you know, I, I want to work with someone who doesn't, who may not need my help. You know what I'm saying? Who seems like they got it going on all their own. Like I have to explain to them why they need me. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I'm not looking for those folks who are seeking me out because those folks aren't ready. Most of the time, they're looking for an easy way out. Those people that are seeking my help, you know what I'm saying? Are looking for yeah. easy way out. They're looking for me to pay for things. You know what I'm saying? They're looking for me to open the doors for themselves. I'm looking for someone who who is who is going out there and working it on their own and you know my strength or, or my juice will just uh fuel what it is that they're doing got you okay dope now for, now i want y'all to really listen to this because keep this in mind the things that we're teaching y'all right now like in this 30-day challenge this is to set you up for somebody like ian to see you and be like yo Jermaine Dupree, what up? Yo, I got this artist right here who's super dope. You might wanna, you might wanna take a look. You know what I'm saying? That so essentially that's what it takes. It takes you being able to produce dope content, creative content. We talked about content continuously. Um outside of the box, man. Outside of the box. So Ian, what so I'm gonna give you one of our strategies that we kind of talked about and let me know if this would kind of catch your eye. Um you know, based off of, you know, just you scrolling through TikTok, TikTok um, and Instagram reels. Um, one of the one of the ideas that, that we've been giving um, the students is it essentially taking a taking something that's trending and doing something creative with it, whether it's a, some sort of song like a little eight bar, eight bar song about something that's trending. Right. Um, mm -hmm. Obviously making it eye catching, though, for instance, um, Nate Robinson getting knocked out. I don't know if you remember that he got knocked out by yeah, Jake Paul at the end of the Michael year. Paul Brothers, yeah. I yeah. Saw that. So like something like that, that's funny, 
and essentially making making a song out of it, like a little eight bar song with little clips from the from the actual video. If if the song is put together like in a dope way that's creative and kind of funny, is that something that will make you be like, hmm, let me let me check out, let me see what else they got because I'm laughing so hard at this right now. Let me just be curious and, and see what else is going on. Is that something that that might catch your eye? Not yes. saying okay, cool. Not saying that yeah. you would be like, yo, I'm trying to sign him today, but just putting him on your radar, essentially. Yes, exactly. Like there, there's an artist named um uh, Alexis Branch. Um, that has a single out called Ooh Baby. Um, and what she did was she took, you know, one of those little trending videos of the bottle. I don't know the, the, the person, the woman kicking the bottle and the bottle flying out of the scene. And, you know, it, it ended up popping her in the face. You know what I'm saying? And she throws yep. the bottle. And, you know what I'm saying? It, the whole setup with her, the way she had that video edited just had me dying. And the video ended up going viral. It got over two, three million views. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Wow. So and I know I watched it over and over again. Um, uh, you know, and it was set to to the music, her, her, her single that she has out, Ooh Baby, which was up for Grammy consideration, actually. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So... Um, yeah, things like that will definitely, things that, that make me laugh, you know what I'm saying, will definitely catch my attention. Uh, and you can reuse trending videos and edit them the proper way uh, yeah. or, or, or something that matches what you're trying to do and, and still be funny, you know? Yeah. 